smartlocal.com We interrupt this program to bring you a public service announcement. Citizens of Singapore, we are now in the midst of a war. Please stay indoors and avoid any sorts of communication until further instructions are broadcasted. I repeat, we are now in the midst of a war. Hi! What is your biggest worry in your day-to-day -day life? To be real, right, if I miss the bus. Because I live very far from the office, so if I miss one bus in the morning, I also don't need to go office already. Whether we're even gonna live until old age, cause you know how the environment is just completely going to shit. And, you know, we're not even helping ourselves, cause we're shooting missiles at each other, and you never know when the next world war is gonna start. Aside from being cannibalized food, then it's got to be being hungry, just because I spend so much time eating. Did you do anything back in school to commemorate Total Defence Day. I remember in primary school, on Total Defence Day, we ate watery, watery porridge with sweet potato during recess, and that was the only thing that they served in the canteen. And a lot of people were complaining about it. I remember, like, got the sound of and then just look, but cannot see anything. And then got like performances, la. I think sometimes they would invite the civil defence to come down and showcase how good your extinguisher is. Like, on this episode of Singaporeans Try, we will be doing the World War II diet for a week. Wow! World War II diet for a week? Oh my god! Wow! Attention all citizens of Singapore. Rations will only be provided twice during this rough period. The first ration will include sweet potatoes, sweet potato leaves, rice, fish and papaya. Of which you may use any cooking methods and condiments to prepare your dish. However, to avoid consuming poison from the enemy, make sure you drink plain water throughout this period. Stay safe out there. So your challenge starts now. Okay, give me my job, please. Okay, so it is day one of the World War II diet challenge and I am gonna have breakfast which I have prepared. I can't take coffee for the entire week, so I'm highly depending on this fruit which I hope has sugar. I have a pot here and I put my fish, my vegetables and my sweet potato here. My rice is here and I just got my boiling hot water. I'm just gonna steam everything today. This looks like the rabbit pellet. You know where they chew? It doesn't taste very bad because it is actually quite sweet but this is literally the amount I'm gonna eat. It's currently like 4 plus right now. I haven't eaten anything for the whole day. I'm gonna snack on some papaya. Hopefully that will be feeling. Hello my little potato. I'm trying to find videos for different recipes on how to cook rice and papaya. But it seems like I need other ingredients which I cannot get because resources are low. Oh my god! Oh, oh, yeah. oh no, oh no! This one is left over. I cannot, I cannot. Wow! Cannot waste, huh? Cannot be fair, huh? Like during war, maybe you only have rice. Then suddenly got one bird drop on you because die. When you cook what, right? Same thing. The bird drop. I was inspired by that video I was watching in the morning, so I'm gonna attempt some papaya rice. I do wanna say that it's already 2.30 and I'm finally having my lunch. I didn't eat in the morning because I wanted my meal to last me for the most of the day. Happy Chinese New Year to all. Although this usually calls for celebration, we urge you to stick to the instructions given to you. And lastly, stay strong. Nope! Oh, 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 Chinese view, what? Often during World War, got Chinese view also, right? You also eat, right? This thing. Can I put it in? The Japanese thing on the first day of Chinese view. Oh, then they never do it here. They never do it. Oh no. Ah, oh, wow, I feel so bad now, eh. Citizens of Singapore, the black market ration card is here. With this card, you are entitled to eat one saucer plate full of anything you desire. However, to earn this card, men will have to travel 1km for carrying 5kg worth of rice and a 5kg weight. Women will have to traverse the same distance carrying 5kg worth of rice. Good luck to all of you. Thank you.
This is the best way to put things. I'm gonna take half of Reyna's weight and do the last lap for him. Okay, Reyna, squat! Squeeze oh. your ass! Squeeze your ass! <laughs> you think the ass comes from nowhere, huh? Squeeze! Up, Reyna! Squeeze, yes! Oh. Ah. Last one! Last one! Oh. Yeah! No, what are you looking for? I'm looking for my ration card. If I don't have it, right? I cannot get ration for three days. Do you think somebody steal? I don't know, eh. Like they take my. So they get more ration. Your steal? My ration card? <laughs> you look guilty as. I <laughs> um. <laughs> have you seen my ration card? You lost it. It was on my table. I and you were sitting on my table. I did not. Are you accusing me of taking <laughs> No, I just I just want to check. This mine. This is child. Oh, this is child. Mine says child. Yeah. Oh, this is child. Yeah. 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 The second ration will be issued today. It will include gong gong, sweet potatoes, and rice. Please stick with the same procedures given to you throughout the rest of this period. Stay safe out there. The catch is cannot. <laughs> Oh, thank you, thank you. What's your name? Spell your name. Uh, C H O W. Correct. Thank you. I can go. What is this? Thank you. But I still need your card. How about you another ration? Okay. I no money and no food. Is it this one? Wait, how do you get this? Any help? So I'm going to be using my black mate card today because I want to eat with my team. So, use! This is not even the first layer. I'm going to be doing one layer over here and I'm going to put like some sauce and then I can chop one more layer and then some sauce and chop one more layer so that I maximize this black market coupon. Fish bao. Fish bao. Fish bao. Tau kwa. And this veggie. It's veggie. So I just finished my dinner and I am very very happy as you can see from my face. So I haven't decided on what I'm gonna do yet. Literally the ration has been cut down by a lot. Previously if you remember right, the ration for the rice was actually full. Now it is just this. Oh it looks damn good. Mashed sweet potato. Who would have thought of that? Oh. Wow, it's amazing how this is a simple ingredient like a sweet potato, right? It's so tasty when you're so hungry. So I'm in NTC right now and I'm going to be buying sambal for my sambal kangkong. I realized that because there's no limit to the condiments, I'm going to spice up my kangkong because I am so sick and tired of boiled and baked stuff. It's 8 o'clock and I woke up because my stomach was grumbling. It's not the best feeling to wake up too. I never needed to keep myself from eating. This time I know that I might not have enough food to last me to the end of the challenge. It's so hard to think when you're hungry because all you think about is food. It is the last day of the challenge and I am going to be finally using my black market coupon which I have won from the challenge. I have my saucer of anything I desire which is is my special mi sedap noodles with sambal fish and eggs. This has been worth the wait. <sighs> Time to feast. How was the challenge? <sighs> <laughs> I've done like water fasting before uh -huh. but this one felt more painful than this. Your body doesn't have time to adapt to the amount right. of food so they give you a bit then you're like okay the body like okay got food mm. and then suddenly you don't have food and then okay got food and then no have food. No coffee, no Red Bull, that was insane. That was more tired easily. And the worst is like when you wake up at night super hungry but you don't want to eat. Because you know that if you eat now, then things you have nothing for breakfast or like lunch. I need to admit to you both that I cheated <laughs> a lot. Oh, no. I am not proud of it but I did it for various reasons. Yeah. I realised that over the festive season, if I don't eat the food that's already cooked, right, I'm going to put it to waste. Yeah. And I'm going to put the people's efforts to waste. What is one takeaway from I did think about how privileged we were yeah. to be able to enjoy the festivities that I have my family with me and that there is peace that I don't need to worry about anything else. When I got the black market thing right, I reserved it for the like last meal, like the dinner time on day 7. And then when I got the sauce, I was like, okay, what do I desire right now? Then guess what I eat? 
No. Sweet <laughs> potato? No, no. <laughs> that would be very sad. Look, I ate noodles. I put Maggi Mee, then I took in whatever leftover that I could stack on top of my Maggi Mee with egg. Then I ate that. And it was like the most delicious thing ever in the world. Now I'm just like, actually, what do I really desire? I am presented with this opportunity to eat whatever I want, but now I'm choosing to take something simple. Thank you for watching this episode of Singapore and Shrine. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and ring our notification bell down below. And watch our other videos over there. Bye! Bye. Happy Total Defense, Defense Day! Day. <laughs> <laughs> we are the three pillars, pillars of, of defense. defense. Huh? <laughs> <laughs>